Doesn't B12 look like birth control? I've actually been meaning to measure how much. Ooh. Do you see? Do you see that? Water everywhere. I've been meaning to measure how much water goes in my cup just so I can keep track better. Because, oh, too high. Better. Because I want to make sure I'm staying hydrated. Vitamins for the day. Vitamins for the day. Check. They're going to start making loud sounds. So we're going to pause and I'll be right back, okay? And we're back. Hello and good morning. Almost afternoon. Sorry, I did want to start the vlog earlier, but there is construction quite literally right outside my window of my apartment. They have been drilling and hammering and there is lots of sound. So we're starting it a little bit later, but that's fine. This construction is supposed to be a three week thing and we are on week three. So fingers crossed that this is actually the last week of the construction. I really hope. The drilling sound literally shakes the entire apartment and it sounds like the construction is inside my apartment because it's literally like right there. It's also been very awkward because um, there's people and I'm just trying to like live my life and they're just doing their work and it's like we're both just pretending we don't see each other. Anyways, hello guys and welcome to the vlog. Happy Monday. I hope everyone is doing well. I don't remember if I said this but I took a little bit of time off from acting just because I was so busy and then with holidays and all that fun stuff. Oh. Oh, it's so cute. This is my last week of vacation. I told my agent that I will be back as of January 28th and literally January 28th, I have a photo shoot. So for a web series that I filmed back in October, it's actually a project that's like really close to my heart. Everybody who was involved with the series, I loved talking to them and working with them. It was such a privilege. So I'm definitely excited for my photo shoot. Not sure how much of it I can vlog, but there's definitely gonna be a little bit of behind the scenes because it is my last week before getting back in the swing of acting and doing all those fun things. I've decided that I really want to figure out how health and fitness can fit into my schedule. If you watch my first vlog, which if you haven't, I will link it right up here and it'll definitely be in the description as well, which if you watch my first vlog, you know that one of my goals is to figure out a workout routine. The main goal in general is to live a healthier life, eat better foods, take care of my body, move more, drink more water, you know. Ooh. Oh, sorry. Again, construction, literally right outside my window. You've heard it all before. I have nothing new to add to the conversation. All I want is to get my shit together and actually take care of my freaking body. One of those ways that I want to start taking care of myself is to actually start going to the gym. I know for me that it can be a little overwhelming because I feel like I don't know what I'm doing when I go to the gym. To help me kind of get rid of some of that overwhelming feeling, I'm going to scroll TikTok and scroll Pinterest to find some good workout routines that I can do. And I'm also going to plan out a killer playlist. But before doing all that, I actually got myself a new phone case and screen protector. I really do love this phone case. It's really pretty, but it is discolored. It's dirty. I've had it for a while and my new one seems a little bit more sturdy. Plus it's my favorite color. It's purple. All right. So let, oh, I knew that was going to happen. Okay. So I already watched a video on how to actually like do this, how to put the screen protector on, but I have 
never put a screen protector on by myself. Usually they do it at the store. So let me just, I actually don't need this because I don't have a screen protector on my phone right now. I know it's really bad, but that is what this blue thing is for. I'm just gonna clean it, get all the fingerprints off, you know, all that fun stuff. The video made this look really easy. So I'm hoping that it is as easy as the video made it seem. I once got an actual like tech person to put a screen protector on my phone and I was watching him put it on and like there was a hair or a piece of dust or something underneath the actual protector. And he, I watched him like peel he lied down the screen protector and he noticed the dust after the fact and I watched him like peel the protector off and he was picking at the dust and he couldn't get it off. So he just put the protector back on and it was all bubbly and it was crappy. And of course me, I was too nervous to say anything. So I just had a bubbly screen protector that wore off after not that long. I was really upset, but I should have said something, but I was too, too nervous, too shy to. Okay, I wanna make sure there's nothing on my hands because I don't want any dust, any cat hair. Peeling this part off. So far, so good. This is like the moment of truth. I feel like this is gonna be super satisfying to do. Oh. Uh, okay. Ooh, ooh, okay. Whew, okay. I feel like, I feel like I didn't even take a breath there. You know what? I'm going to, I'm going to focus on this and then I'll be right back, okay? That was way easier than I thought it was going to be. Okay, now for the new case. Ooh, nice. Okay, that's much better. This feels so much more protected too. Plus I have like a little clip here which is good because if you know me, I drop my phone on my face way more times than I should. So let's get cooking. Sorry. I wasn't planning on cutting the cherry tomatoes, but I've decided I think I'm going to. And I, ooh, runway tomato. I just got a new cutting board and I'm gonna get a different knife just because I prepared the raw chicken on the other cutting board and I'm not gonna cross contaminate. Don't wanna get sick, so. One thing I wanna do this year is cook more meals at home 
I am a, a slave for convenience. Anything that is quick, easy, and just needs to be warmed up, I'm there. I also am not somebody who cares if I eat the same thing every day, because I normally do. Honestly, my go-to lunches at work are these, or I will, I'll put together a salad kit. Again, quick, easy, takes no time. Since I already eat the same lunch every single day at work, I might as well just bulk prepare something and then I have my lunches for the week. Easy. Okay, chicken is almost done, so I'm going to make the dressing. The couscous is already seasoned, so I don't need to do too, too much, but I'm just gonna add red wine vinegar, regular vinegar, olive oil, salt, pepper, mint. That's it. The couscous looks ready. I also have olives and feta cheese. So my battery died while I was finishing up and I have to leave for work in like 10 minutes, but this is the end result. I have more in that blue bowl right there. This is just my portion for lunch today. I'm gonna do a quick taste test, make sure the seasoning's good, of course. Yeah, I wanna get a little bit of everything. Mm. Mm hmm Okay, perfect. There's just a trouble tail. You want cuddles? That's okay, I can give you some. What is this on your head? What was that on your head, baby? I have to go to work now, so I will see you tomorrow. Oh my gosh, sorry. Was that like that the whole time? Embarrassing. Anyways, good morning, it is Tuesday. I'm just about to take a ginger shot. These, it's gonna focus. There we go. This is my favorite one. Grocery store close to me has this other ginger shot, but it's too powerful. Oh my gosh, I didn't even say it, guys. Guess what? There's no scaffolding out there. Construction workers, gone. Construction, done. I don't think you understand how excited I am. I don't have to wake up to literal drilling anymore. Like the construction would literally shake the apartment. I don't have to listen to that anymore. I'm a happy girl. Okay, cheers. Mm. It's a good burn. All right, y'all, today is the day. I'm going to the gym. Oh, hey Nemo. Vitamins, check. So I scrolled TikTok and Pinterest, like I said I would, and I found some simple beginner workouts. I'm gonna take it super easy. I don't wanna push myself or injure myself or burn myself out. The plan is I'm going to go to the gym once a week for now. I think going to the gym once a week is very reasonable for starting out. And then if I want to start going more, I can put it to two or three. We'll see how I'm feeling. But for now, once a week, totally doable. And I made myself a killer playlist. Honestly, I think I'm more excited for the playlist. Also, is this not the cutest water bottle ever? Again, purple. We all know, purple's my favorite color. But isn't this so stinking cute? I am prepared. But before I go to the gym, I need to organize- Oh my gosh! Oh! oh. Nemo, are you parkouring? Oh my gosh, I wish I got that on camera. That was so cute. Nemo literally just like threw himself off the couch. It was really cute. Before I go to the gym though, I have some laundry that I need to put away because I- I cleaned my closet. That's right. I finally organized my closet. Can I get a round of applause, please? It took me literally no time at all. I spent more time procrastinating cleaning my closet than it took actually organizing my closet. Crazy, I know. You know it's serious because I broke out the cat slippers. Hi.
I just find it hard to get rid of things, especially if somebody gave me something. I had something that was given to me by somebody else. Even if I don't like it, I will hold on to it because somebody gave that to me. There's meaning, there's value, there's sentimentalness. I'm going to try and do this as quick and dirty as possible. These are my work clothes. This is the stuff that I am not sure about yet. I want to try it on first and then see what I want to keep, what I want to get rid of. This is my donation pile for sure. And this is an emo cat. <laughs> this is the stuff I'm going to keep. dreading cleaning my closet just because I assume just because I assumed it was going to be so much work which I have a sneaky suspicion that that is how going to the gym is also going to be so okay am I ready to go to the gym yeah I'll be fine Man, that was way better than I thought it was going to be. Just like I suspected, I made a big deal for no reason. Of course. I was planning on filming in the gym, but there were a lot more people there than I was expecting. So maybe next time? <coughs> but I will say my playlist made a big difference. I'll definitely link that playlist below because honestly it made my workout way more enjoyable. I need to shower because I got my sweat on but I think I'm gonna end the vlog here. It looks like a snowstorm is on its way. That to me screams cozy day in with my book. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I will see you next week maybe with some wallflower photo shoot behind the scenes. I don't know. Who knows? We'll see. We'll see. But thanks again for watching, guys. I'll see you next week. Bye.